Whoa. Welcome to another edition of the Blazing Beard Bulls blog. And yesterday I had a video where I <coughs> kind of got harsh with Derrick Rose. And that was met with a lot of skepticism and a lot of thumbs down. So maybe the Blazing Beard owes Derrick Rose an apology. However, I'm sorry, Derrick Rose. However, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, D Rose, man. I, I loved you, but here's the ultimate point, fans. You can like his game all you want, but if you're a Bulls fan, he's not on the Bulls anymore, right? If you're on the Justice League, right? If you're on the Justice League or you're not, then that's your team or it's not your team. You're the X-Men, Justice League, you name it. Right now, Derrick Rose is not a Chicago Bull, and he's taking an awful lot of time in the media to be like, oh, well... They're showing me a lot more love here in New York City. Yeah, everybody would be excited about getting you, Derrick Rose. It's just the part where they have to watch you sitting on the bench for years and years and years. That's the real bummer when you love basketball. So, do I love Derrick Rose? I love his game, man. We always know that the dude shouldn't open his mouth. But I guess calling him rapey or smelling like a rapist is maybe a little too much. However, we have become in this society a society that only believes one side and then usually dismisses it. Oh, she's just looking for money. She's this, she's that. He could have paid her off a long time ago. This is no longer about that. It's a legal mess that's going to stick all year. And even if I'm not going to celebrate Derrick Rose being an idiot, I definitely am glad that he's not on my team. I'm glad that he's not a Chicago Bull anymore. I wish him all the best of luck in New York City. He thinks New York media is like nice and loves him. Just wait till the season gets started. If you're not an MVP form, that city can be just as cutthroat and harsh, harsh as Chicago. So, Derek, I hope it's not true, but if it is, mm, man, then, you're, then that's like one of the worst things ever. But we don't have to worry about that anymore because we're going to get on to the Bulls season. Blazing Beard is very excited about a new Bulls season. Jimmy Butler is going to take the reins. The rest of the team, Dwayne Wade, is going to be coached, I think, on the court even better by Wade and his example than by, you know, Brace's guy, whose name eludes me. I think he's a coach. Oh, yeah, Freddie Boy. So, from the Blazing Beard to all of you, much love, no hate, Bulls, puff, puff, pass. That's right. Love your brothers and your sisters.